How's it going everyone? It's Ethan here at eTrailer. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Flint Hill Goods 20 by 47 inch hitch cargo carrier on the back of our 2022 GMC Sierra 1500. So this hitch carrier is going to be a good way to get some more space and more storage out of your vehicle. Say your truck bed's full or you have some items in there that you might not want to store. Additionally, you might have some dirty, sandy, muddy items that you don't want to keep in the cab of your vehicle. You can keep them here. This hitch carrier is going to offer you 20, 20 inches of space this way and 47 inches of space this way. Additionally, it will be 5 inches deep, so that's how much you're going to actually have to make contact with the items that you're storing. Also, there are a lot of open spaces, so again, if you do have some of those muddy, sandy items, that'll just fall off and fall through as you go. Compared to another version of the same brand of cargo carriers that we tested, this one does actually have quite a few places for you to tie down your items. The carrier is made of a rust-proof aluminum, so that keeps things pretty lightweight. It's a fairly large carrier, and the collective weight of the carrier itself is only 29 pounds, so that's going to take less away from your total tongue weight, which is nice. Additionally, it does have these built-in reflectors, one on either side, which is going to just let people behind you know if you're driving at night that you do have something on the end of your vehicle. That being said, it is on the end of your vehicle and it does stick out quite a ways from an already pretty long vehicle. So we can go ahead and grab that measurement and see how far exactly it is from the bumper to the furthest point back. It's about 30 inches on the nose. So that is 30 inches that you're adding again to the back of your vehicle. This carrier does not have the ability to tilt or fold, so that's just kind of how it is. The space that you're going to be left with between the bumper of your vehicle and the carrier itself is pretty long. It's about eight and a quarter inches, so I wouldn't necessarily worry about anything, any contact with the bumper itself. The ground clearance is just going to be from the ground basically to the shank of your vehicle because it doesn't rise or bow at all, which will come in at about 16 and 3 quarters inches so the Sierra is a pretty tall vehicle when you're going up hills or over bumps or anything like that that's not something I would worry about either if you don't have anything on the actual carrier itself you will have the ability to pull your tailgate all the way down and sit on it if that's something that you need to do if you want to change your shoes or get any accessories or anything out of the back of your bed that would be fine if you want to store things in the carrier and access your tailgate, you'll only have about eight inches, I believe, to do so from the bottom to that point on the tailgate is about eight inches. So that's how much clearance you're going to get if you want to store things. Obviously, in the back side, you can store some larger items and still get into the tailgate if that's something you need to do. One thing we like to talk about with these hitch cargo carriers is the potential for there to be any sort of heat damages as it relates to the exhaust of your vehicle. Sometimes if you have some canvas bags and things like that and your exhaust is blowing straight out, the heat will actually damage what you're carrying. In the case of our Sierra here, there's only one exhaust and it's down and away, so that's not something that we're going to have to worry about. If you are storing some larger items in the carrier, it's likely going to block your back license plate, so keep that in mind. If you do have some really large items, it still probably won't get in the way of the backup camera. We found that it's pretty tall on the tailgate here, and it can see over most of the taller items that we put on the hitch. Coming down to the shank now, just pointing out that it is a 2-inch shank that fits into our 2x2 two two inch receiver tube. It's held in place by an anti-rattle bolt and a pin and a clip. I think overall the Flint Hill Goods carrier that we have here is a solid fit, a solid option for the 2022 GMC Sierra.